It's me, T from the Patterson Statement of Transit to Bed. Listen, uh, uh, man, uh, this is it's getting near the um, evening time here in Virginia, and uh, usually towards the evening, uh, then I usually do my exercise, my my dance walk exercise. Uh, but I just got to Virginia yes, uh, last night or whatever it was, and um, so I'm, I'll, I'll start back in that tomorrow. I'll rather, yeah, tomorrow. But this morning I did go out with my sister because my sister's on this, you know, this healthy kick finally. And uh, so she walked three miles in the morning. So I walk with her in the morning. So I guess somehow it works out. But I think what I'm going to do is walk with her in the morning to three, you know, three, you know, three miles. And then, you know, afternoon do my do my dance thing. Anyway, um, um, uh, I realized that I was, there's a lot of things happening. The first thing that kicked it off was uh, Kamala Harris, you know, you know, closing up to uh, Andrew Yang and, you know, with the two $2,000 uh, UBI. I figured that's a way to try to get to be vice president. But there's a lot of other interesting political things, political moves, or, or things that should happen. Let me give you a one I think that's very, very interesting to me, and that is, uh, you know, when, when, when uh, the president, with Trump and and stuff like, was talking about telling, telling me, you know, the police, whoever, the governors, whoever they were selling to, you know, clamp down and destroy them or whatever he's saying, beat them or dominate them or whatever he was, his words were. It's kind of interesting because you know words somebody else well word me well, i would say hmm i say look this country i was just this country saying i need all the governors to fly your flags at half at half staff you know that's the first thing i would do it's easy it's easy just about everything but do you reason why he's not doing that because he thinks he's going to keep his his sort of like police military thing might behind him that he remember the first when he first came to op, the, the op with all those people with the with the with the braids and the medals and, and you know and the stern looks whatever have you he thinks that's that support is going to stay with him i don't know i have no idea so, anyway, so now you say that's something that's really creative easy, easy to do you know what i mean if you're a political, any governor can do the same thing say, we're going to fly we're going to fly this thing at uh, um, at a uh, half staff for i don't know for long for until we until something happens, I don't know what it is. But the other thing I was thinking is there's a lot of creative things that's happening. I just heard that they somebody wrote uh, uh, or painted on uh, somehow uh, in the White House going towards the White House a big huge thing that says Black Lives Matter painted on the streets leading to the White House. All oh, those kind of creative things is always going to happen. So, so, so of course you know you can do stuff like that. But here I am thinking also there's a lot of things that we should be doing just just easy. Uh, 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 just on your own way. I, mean, I know protests. You can do. We can do all that stuff. And I know it's bad for me because, uh, I mean, I'm I'm like those uh, journalists. Those 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 go to two people. You know, they, they they come and they they read their news to you and then they tell you what you should do or shouldn't do. I'm not telling you any of that, right? I actually can't do anything. Of course, I'm in I'm in uh, I'm in mourning for my for for my brother who passed. So I actually can't partake in anything at least until uh, I think September for 90 days. Uh, and we start with our nine nights. Anyway, uh, one thing I wanted to say, especially about this police and everything that's happening, I had an interesting situation when I was, uh, I lived in Princeton uh, for a while on Lee Avenue, in the same place where um, uh, Paul Robeson, I lived on Paul Robeson Street. Yeah, not when he was alive, it doesn't matter. Um, but where I lived, this was in the early, this was in the early 70s. Uh, I lived with the old, uh, I rented a, a room when these really old people, you know what I mean, old black people. But Lee Avenue, this is the get, uh, look, Princeton Black community at the time was just like one street, <laughs> you know. Um, anyway, uh, these real old people, and they were like in their 70s, 80s, I don't know, they're old, right? A couple. And um, and I asked the guy, because I'm, I'm like, a, well, I've read a whole lot of uh, Richard Wright. Anyway, uh, so I was asking him one time, I said, you know, I said, I asked, I said what happened when... Uh, when Native Son came out, because I know that Richard Biden six, so I, I know that Richard Biden wrote it. He wrote it essentially as a two-dimensional character. That's why when he, when the fifties, when he, in the early fifties, fifty-three, when he wrote, oh, he wrote um, Na uh, uh, Native Son in about what nineteen thirty-nine, whenever it was. But um, fifty-three, he reworked Native Son as the outsider, and the difference was the outsider was a full, fully fledged character, a three-dimensional character when we never said he purposely made it as a two-dimensional character but i bring this up to say what i asked the the guy because the the, the 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 old couple the woman was bedridden uh, uh but the old guy said well, you know uh, when this when the, when this book you know when this book what, what was what was it like when this book came out i think i was just reading it at the time or reading oh, i was reading the outside at the time i asked him about native so some somehow that lives so uh, yeah i don't know what, what what the circumstance was but he said oh that book he said you know when that happened now this this couple the guy was the 
I think he was a chauffeur and the woman was the, uh, maybe he was the butler. I think it was the butler chauffeur and the woman was, you know, the house, the, the, the housekeeper or whatever it is of this white couple, rich white couple. And they, of course, are black. And uh, he said, oh, yeah, when that came out, the, the mistress came to me. To, basically, he was saying, like, remember, it was, on, it, was, it was the first black book on the book club, the, whatever that book club they, they used to have, you know, it was the first black one. And he said, when that book came out, the, 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 the help, you know what I mean, like, like the chauffeurs, well, not the chauffeurs, the, um, the, the white madams, mistress, the, the white people, they would go to their, their, their chauffeurs and, and to their, their help and say, is this true? Talking about Native Son, is this true? It was interesting because that means that they never said anything to black people until the sensation of this book came out. And so what's happening now? You know, white people all of a sudden say, hey, is this, what's, what's going on? Huh? Because something happened and now it's in their consciousness too. Anyway, I bring up to say that because when I was living in Princeton, the interesting thing, remember this is the early 70s, uh, the interesting thing was that the cops in Princeton, I never had any problems with the cops, I never had problems with any, most cops, um, and, um, you know, um, they were very interesting, they were, they were nice, they were polite, they never bothered me at all, you know, and I was a black guy that looked like a black guy. Uh, but at the same time, uh, yeah, then I got out, so then I was up uh, in, um, at one time I lived, I think it was Edison, New Jersey, or right up there, um, maybe it's right above, uh, uh, right above, right above Highland Park, somewhere around there. Anyway, those police were the worst. There wasn't Edison, Edison's all the way up. This is like Highland Park, somewhere right outside of Highland Park. These people was the worst. So you have like, you know, basically within an hour, whatever, you know, have one police force that, that had, uh, it's not because it was printed, they were just trained better, I guess because they had, you know, distinguished people. But the one up there above Highland Park, wherever that area was, um, was those are the dredges of the earth? Those those are well, racist, racist, racist. You know what I mean? So in the state, you had this, and of course, everybody knows about the state troopers and South School and all the rest of that stuff. So what I'm what am I saying? I'm saying I guess it depends on um, what you, what you do, where you are, um, what happens. So if your if, if if your police form, your local police thing is messed up, yeah, everybody knows it. The thing is, what you going to do about it? And this is the time to do about it. So anyway, so I just wanted to bring that up because I think there's there's creative things that we should be doing. I mean, no, don't get me wrong, people can do whatever they do. I'm not, I'm not telling anybody to do nothing, you know what I mean? But certain of us can do other things. Again, I can't do it. Right now, I'm, I'm using on freedom. Krishna Um I think I have to, I think I like, I like it out here. So I think in the afternoons, maybe I'll come and maybe I'll, I'll read a little Krishna Murti uh, and then talk about Krishna Murti a little bit. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, but by the way, Krishna Murti, thanks to um, um, uh, Zoe Williams. Of the zo so what whatever out there in California, you know what I mean? Because in listening to his his cast, you know, because I'm because I'm a fifty one fifty kind of person, you know what I'm saying? I uh, you know, I run with Corey. I'm sorry, yeah, you know, that's the way it is, right? I run with Yvette and Tone, but I also run with Corey, <laughs> and 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 so. Um, but anyway, uh, 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 he highly recommend Krista Murphy. I've been to India, but a lot of philosophers. I mean, you know, Sri Aurobindo. I mean, I know a lot of uh, India, but I never knew, really knew about Krishna Murthy, but it's an amazing cat. And so I'm going to, the rest of the time I'm here, I'm going to deal with this or whatever where we see. Anyway, that's a little message for me uh, for a little ADOS consciousness, which is uh, struggle consciousness. We'll see what happens. Take care. <laughs>